I, I wrote a play after coming back and I thought, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll create a soap opera character mm -hmm. and she's big in India. Then I can get this clash of cultures. So she goes to India to visit her fans because she has to. Right. It's her biggest audience. So she prepares her speech for the Rotary Club of New Delhi and um, the chambermaid comes in and they start this strange kind of friendship. And um, it, it ends up that the woman, um, the woman uh, chambermaid, who's, who's been told so many times by this actress, I really want to help you. I really am serious about um, helping somebody like yourself. I see what poverty there is here. And, and the woman said, yeah, well, I, I, we, we don't have much money. And, and so one night, and it, you never quite know whether it's for real or not, but she brings her granddaughter and she says, were you serious about wanting to help my family? And she says, of course I was. She says, well, here is my granddaughter. Would you take her back to America? And then very quickly, the woman backpedals. And <laughs> so it's really, that's it. Okay. And, um, and so I, I wrote to the BBC and I wrote to about five regional centres and got lots of thanks very much, but no thanks. And then the reply I got, which was positive, was a, a woman called Tanya Nash and uh, her mother was Indian. And you just need those little mm -hmm. lucky strikes, don't you? Mm -hmm. And she said, actually, I am interested in your story. And so could you, could you change it? Could you make it her go different places and stuff like that? And it ended up on radio for, uh, for one of the afternoon plays. This is about three or four years after I'd, after I'd um, been to India. And we'd staged it in the interim as a stage play, which was called Soap for the Untouchable. And uh, so this a bit like Svenborg, you know, it's gone through various incarnations. And um, that we did that at the Fringe, actually. It was very, very, very successful with some great actors and actresses. And, um, and so then, uh, yeah, she, she, she made it in, in... I never saw them. I never met the cast. I never met the producer. It was all done via email, which is a little oh. unsatisfactory, but there you go. <laughs> yeah. So I'm in, I'm in Britain on my summer holiday in my hire car, and we pulled into a car park in Tenby, and my radio play comes on, and I wipe down the windows. <laughs> Turn no. up really loud, yeah. and I'm yeah. shouting at people, I wrote this letter. Yeah, this is mine. Amazing. That's cool. That's very cool. Um, I, wow, that's, that's a big achievement, though, to get uh, to get some writing onto onto the BBC and BBC Radio Four. Um, that's super cool. 